I saw this post in my feed today a couple of times, which is apparently by some Danish professor in psychology called Sven Brinkman. And this, it caught my attention because, yeah, I, I'm trying to, it's in Swedish here, but I'm trying to translate it for you in, in real time. It says like this. If you think positive every day, you work hard, you strive to become the best version of yourself, you surround yourself with inspiring people, and you never give up, then there's no limits to how much you might crash and burn. Yeah? It's a good quote. Can? It might, might happen, yeah. I've been there myself, I burnt myself to a crisp. I know how it is. But I still think we need to consider the alternative. If you do not think positive every day, you don't work hard, you do not strive to become the best version of yourself, you, s you don't surround yourself with inspiring people, and you give up every now and then. Well, what's going to happen then? Well... Maybe you won't. You won't get. Maybe you won't crash and burn and have a bad burnout like I did. But you will have something even worse. Regret. What happens when you're lying on your deathbed? And you know you spent time with toxic people who suck the energy out of you. And you know you didn't pursue your dreams and you didn't do what you knew was right in here. And you didn't do your best. If you just sell for average. Life is not a rehearsal. You got one shot at it. And even though if you do your very best, you work super hard, you have a wonderful family, you start a business, it takes off and everything is like perfect. And then you get cancer. Can be over like this. It happens all the time. I think about it every day, personally. Not one day goes by without me thinking this is the last day on earth for me. How should I spend it? And that's why I, I work. I try to push myself. I work super hard. I try to push myself to the absolute limit every single day of my life. Because I believe that the alternative is even worse. I'm not gonna allow myself to have any regrets when it's time for me to put, take down the sign and leave this earth. No way. So, it's a funny quote. There's, there's truth in it. But there's more, more to it too. I, I'd say I, I, I can never ever settle with average. I will strive for... for I, I, I have potential in me. And I want to realize as much of it as I possibly can. It's my duty. It's my duty to everyone that came before me. It's my duty and obligation to everybody who lives now. And it's my absolute duty to do it for everyone that comes after me. I need, I need to do my best. I feel like a party pooper here, but it's, it's really important, this. It reminds me of the story of Cain and Abel, which deals with this topic. But there are, there are no guarantees that even though you make sacrifices, that the universe will treat you good. No guarantees whatsoever. I just know that the alternative is even worse. If you don't, if you don't, put your back into it. Even worse things will happen sooner or later. Well, <laughs> have a nice weekend. Ciao.